All right, welcome to Simply 15, a new 15-minute podcast by Simplistic Reviews, where we talk about really anything we want for 15 minutes. Today, we're going to be talking about WandaVision, the season of WandaVision that is the only season we're going to be getting. Oh. Maybe, perhaps, uh, by chance. If we know. do, I'll shit my pants. No, you will. you're going to be shitting your pants, well, but... I'm going to shit my pants regardless. <laughs> That's how good it was. It was so, good. without further ado, let's get into our review. Mm. Um, what is the one word review you would give one division? Let's start with, uh, I'll go first. How's that sound? How about you go first? The white guy goes first. <laughs> I don't want it to be racist. I'm just trying to help you guys out. In case you don't have an idea of what you want to say, you can give yourself a little bit of time. Well, okay. Well, we lead the way. I'm not trying to extend this, so to give you guys more time to think about it. Okay. Yeah, fine. WandaVision, I thought, was absolutely wonderful. Oh. That would be my one. What, 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 what a just a plain word, wonderful. Wonderful? No, I think wonderful and composite. It, it was wonderful in the beginning when it was in the 19, you know, 60s it, it, and yeah. 70s and we went to the 80s or whatever and 90s. It was absolutely fantastic. Um, the, the, everything about it, the, the idea and the characters who I've now have a more greater love for vision and wanda in fact right. i think now they are at my top of my favorite with the avengers really uh, going wow. forward i am going to yeah i mean well we all know scarlet witch is the most powerful being She's in the badass. entire they finally, universe boom, they put it out they there. did yeah. and that was great and vision we'll get into as well but i love vision i mean i've always liked these characters but now i i, I fucking love them so uh-huh. Uh, let's go with DJ. What did you, uh, how, what's your one word review? I, I, with all the, vi- not say vitriol, but like the discussion online, I'm going to go with delivered. Uh, in terms of the title of the show, Wanda Vision, Wanda and Vision, they nailed it completely. The acting, the focus of the story, chef's kiss, everything was great. I mean, a TV show that actually gets me to get a little bit of an emotional, I'm not saying I'm crying, it's a little bit of, you get a little emotional, like is 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 a testament to Paul Bettany, who is a fucking god amongst insects at this point. He's so good. I'm just happy he's being utilized. There are certain things I really, really did not expect to like, like Jimmy Woo, like Monica Rambo, like Agatha Harkness. That I I can't do without now. I want Agatha Harkness to be female Loki. I want Monica Rambo to have her own movie. I want Jimmy Woo to be new Coulson. The what only about Darcy th- Lewis. Darcy, I can take her leave. We'll get to that. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> the only thing I could say, I, I, in terms of the uh, the things I didn't like, and it's I'm the comic book head here. Uh, it's not the it, it was the, the the Lucy pulls a football moment of the show, and I'm not talking about Mephisto or all this stuff that you could read in. I'm talking about the active decision to cast Evan Peters when you know what that means and then you it's essentially a fuck you which means that the whole thing that nothing that's the, the only gripe i have everything else like the mephisto stuff not showing up or dr strange not showing up or reed richards i don't care about that that's fine no, that was a cool no, little mystery. you didn't need any of that yeah yeah but the, the when you you don't cast evan peters on an accident and that was a, it felt like very iron man 3 we've already talked about how much i didn't like about that but we're talking about stuff i liked the acting of this show is, I think it's going to go under the radar how good Paul Bettany and Elizabeth Olsen is. She's fantastic. He's fantastic. They're fantastic together. I even like the kids. So WandaVision, I mean, I don't know how Falcon Winter Soldier is going to follow this. That's what I'm worried about. Two weeks we'll find out. Yeah. All right, Matt, what's your one-word review? Well, you guys, you said wonderful. You said delivered. I'm using the word brunch. Ooh, because look at this guy. The reason I'm hungry. using the word brunch is because I, after I got done watching uh, the series on Tuesday and Friday, or Saturday, I finished it off. Then I yeah. kind of I started going back to mm. the other. I, I went back to Doctor Strange, and you know what? I have even more appreciation for Doctor Strange. I love yeah. fucking Doctor Strange no matter what, mm-hmm. but now I love it even more because all the little pieces in WandaVision were all the pieces that we saw what, three or four years ago when Doctor Strange came out? It's like, we didn't know what we were going to get. So it's, I'm, getting, I'm getting my lunch, I'm getting my breakfast, I'm getting all my food, 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 food. I'm fucking eating it up, eating it up, eating it up. Um, and it was 
I, I like the fact that they subverted some expectations, but you know, in to your to your Evan Peters argument a little bit, they could still be fucking with you. Evan Peters could still be Quicksilver in this. Sure, episode. sure, sure. Because yeah. at the yeah. same time, this whole series was made to mind fuck you. Anything's possible. Yeah. So it, it could yeah. be my work could either be brunch or mind fuck. I kind of uh, I'm still gonna go I with like brunch, mind fuck. <laughs> but I like mind fuck a little bit more because you know it, it it fucked up a lot of people and it kind of uh brought to justin's point you know yeah. it's like yeah. oh we well, finally have, we finally have a show where we got to explore a little bit more of these characters we don't know so much much about are we going to get more of that in falcon and the winter soldier it's like oh we got to get to delve into their uh backstory even though i think we have a lot of winter soldier backstory mm. already sam yeah. wilson definitely we'll yeah. get more sam wilson now so i yeah. like the fact that we're getting more g- give me give me more of this give me nine episodes. yeah no it 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 really is that good and unfortunately it's kind of a one and done limited series i kind of want to maybe talk about the last couple episodes right. particularly the ending uh, mm-hmm. something we haven't discussed yet mm-hmm. and honestly i thought i was kind of guessing things as it was going along and then it turned out i was wrong right uh, for example and I, of course we don't give a shit about spoilers because at this no. point if you're listening you've seen it already. probably already spoilers, seen it right now. i guess flash it big on the screen right now so we're gonna fucking spoil you if but you yeah spoilers but vision i thought um when they brought the new vision back or the old vision but the oh let's call him the bino white vision, vision. Yeah. The, the, bino white, vision. the og the og vision <laughs> which kind of reminded me of paul bettany in uh the da vinci code yeah, it, yeah, oh yeah. Holy Except shit. He, I never he wasn't back together. His, I like he, he wasn't yeah. whipping his back, but yeah, he's the yeah, I knew what that character was called. Oh, the guy I, that beats I, himself I, with yeah, the whip. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I thought the way that they should have done that, and and but you he disappears. Right. So yeah. that's pretty open-ended. So there might be oh, something yeah, yeah, there. Definitely. But I well, thought so, when Vision yeah. was opening his mind, he was transplanting himself inside I, I, he, because that body. He, he doesn't really Maybe. have to. The point is he just has to because he's a uh, he's a memory vision. of Wanda. He's, he's yeah. He he's, has he's all Wanda. those yes, memories, but they do yeah. have physical. They do contact. Fight. Right. They have right, contact. Right. So yeah. I feel like there was some kind of barrier that we were breaking. Mm-hmm. I kind of wish or hope that Vision comes back in in another form. Um, what do you guys think of the ending? I, 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 the last episode, because I'm a Star Trek nerd, and it wasn't all the fighting. It was. The conversation in the library, I love so much. And I like the fact that Matt brings up Doctor Strange, that in the two magical shows that were things we've had, that the winning person doesn't win by physical violence. Wanda outsmarts them. Doctor Strange beats their mom by outsmarting him. Mm -hmm. Vision beats other Vision by throwing a paradox in. That to me is more satisfying than, I punched you really hard. (laughs) That to me, I thought was very, very well done and the theseus the theseus uh conversation straight out of that was unexpected that was like okay we're gonna get into this like who built the boat dude yeah theseus's boat it's like in the middle of like two fucking like androids what what a fix it's a data data situation yeah basically so so i i I like that and going into the i mean as a comic book person i like her embracing the Scarlet Witch thing was like, oh, yeah, finally. we finally get Scarlet hey, Witch. The fucking and costume is there. The costume's fucking like awesome. that. So the costume it's worker. cool. Yeah. I mean, it's 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 retro enough, but it's still new enough to kind of be cool and everything. I like that. Um, I don't know if that I wasn't expecting. I'm like, oh, they're just gonna fucking fully embrace. She like is it. not Wanda anymore. She is Scarlet Witch at this point. Yeah. So, I mean, good to do. To, yeah, that was great. They that, really, so. uh, they really uh, shot that character forward and uh which is great because i think the next film she pops up and would probably have a full scarlet it might be spider-man it might be strange i'm hoping it's spider i just like the multiverse aspect i like that you have uh, agatha harkness they didn't get rid of her she's still in existence thank god in some way she's (laughs) mirror dimension maybe or something like that which which makes me appreciate she knows where to find her she's been just (laughs) Put into a, a place that they'll find her at some point so yeah i loved it i think yeah, I, I thought it was good it was done well and, i thought the know. ending was great um you know it didn't really let me down as much as is i didn't get to see it uh right when it premiered and i was right. kind of walking around twitter and whatnot a little yeah. scared until yeah. something would <laughs> pop up but I, I stayed away until saturday when i can watch it I was like, yeah good, i can watch it now so perfect yeah. 
So yeah, it was hard, but I, a lot of people were dissing it. I honestly thought it was great. I, you know, I dissed it when we first heard about it. One division. I hated the title. I love the title now. Now it makes so much so sense. It makes, it makes absolute I, sense. I, I like the title to be. I was like, oh, one. I hated division. it when they they're, premiered they're it. I said it on the shit. podcast. Like, oh, this is There's two. Retro there was TV two projects shit. that I was not. I was scared about in this after end game phase. And one division was number one. <laughs> I was like, yeah. I don't understand how this is gonna work. And then like. After the third episode, I'm like, oh, this is awesome. I can just watch this all the time. It's, it's fantastic. You can it tell was... when Kevin Feige is like real, because this is like his kind of pet project thing where he's really behind something. And I think, I mean, the mis- the things that I did not, people have a problem with of the show are so tiny. <laughs> well, what'd you have a problem with? We got, we got yeah, four yeah. minutes no, left. I mean, what did you got a problem with? No, I mean, no, no, I'm not. Me I, I didn't have just, many problems. No, ex- no, no, except I, for that one character that we just alluded to. Oh no, no the right. one you talked about the before. the Evan Peters thing. I I had the, the the pretty much the biggest problem with, and the you could tell in the last episode they were kind of rushing stuff because yeah. the bad guy becomes all of a sudden super bad out of nowhere, yeah. kind of. And I, I can tell if it was a little bit more time. You can tell they were just trying to rush, but. They were rushing ancillary. They weren't rushing the main thing. And that's no. why I give it a pass because yeah. they did not like Darcy, rush for example, I thought, I was like, ah, she's going to be a big thing in that last episode. And she yeah. wasn't. No. She had Literally in a scene, pretty <laughs> much. That was yeah. it. Yeah, Which is great. And that's fine. I'm good with that. Because it's kind of annoying, I figured. I, I thought every time <laughs> she kind of started coming on, I was like, all right, I'm getting a little sick and tired of this. <laughs> I think her com- chemistry with Wu, Jimmy Wu and Monica were good. So she, they, yeah, they were a good team. A yeah, the three kind of Earthlings kind of coming team. together doing their own thing is is good. Jimmy Wu's awesome. Jimmy Wu. Oh yeah, I awesome. like I like Jimmy Wu when he first appeared in Ant Man. I'm like, I like I like his I character. I like him in Ant Man. I mean, because I don't like Ant Man. I mean, that's I, right. my, I don't know. It's like Ant Man is stupid. See, I liked Ant Man. I didn't really care for him either. It just yeah. it's just something like that. Like there's like that that that. that the, the wacky goofy type thing that kind of gets jammed down your throat it, it almost yeah, kind of puts but, you but off a little bit you yeah. kind of want it but you kind of don't want it right now and now you're getting it and you're like nah, i'm good with it right now Clark just, greg doesn't get enough credit for how he walked that line of goofy yeah, and yeah. then oh shit he can fuck you up whenever yeah, he yeah. wants kind of situation yeah. and woo's got to kind of lean a little bit more into that's what i was hoping he's gonna beat the shit out of what's his name hardgrave hardware hard oh yeah uh, uh, the, yeah the the, the yeah. Sword guy bad like sword that, guy. So. It was pretty was bad too. That was a yeah. bad, pretty bad guy. That I came out of no. They rushed. Yeah, he was, he was, yeah I mean, they rushed. It. I was like, <laughs> he's getting well, evil. Problem, he's fucking yeah. shooting at kids. Chill, the last like, wait, wait, yeah. You got you to explain blame. that, buddy. <laughs> yeah, he's popping. He popped the whole clip into the kid. Almost. <laughs> if it was like a tranquilizer dart, I can understand. No, but no, was, like, I'm going to shoot you in a real bad kid. Yeah, like that's like a nice villain, right? Tranquilizer. Fuck me, right? Yeah, it was pretty pretty violent almost for a second, and then he got crushed by Darcy. So yeah, it worked out all right. I heard heard Darcy was a COVID thing. Uh, uh, I think they were. It was like a pickup shot because she wasn't available on set because of. Uh, Oh, because of COVID. I mean, that's what I heard. That's fine. I'm fine with that. The fine that that you didn't need more to make this like movie or this show take place during COVID and stuff like that too. Like a big production like this happen is pretty kind of astonishing but i think we're going to expect more of this goofy stuff coming up because yeah. we're, now we're getting into space shit magic i hope everything, soon everything is off the oh, loki's gonna now. give you all of that baby i Loki's mean you're gonna, gonna get all the white you we got a little bit of wackiness shit. in there just some of the wacky 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 now we're gonna I get hope. full when's on. loki when's that coming out that's, that's after, gonna come after winter, winter. winter so okay. i would say what eight eight or nine episodes of falcon and winter soldier okay. and look what they're doing with that that's gonna be doctor who but marvel yeah essentially yeah. time yeah. jumping all over the place yeah. that's Which, perfect um, hey make i'm it, looking make forward it nuts, to it make it crazy i mean <laughs> you're gonna get more of your spy espionage stuff with falcon and winter Soldier. that's my that's my wheelhouse baby. It, it, this, this is your buddy that, uh, this is gonna be your buddy you know cracking jokes between people give me that bad make it bad boys and i'm happy just yeah, make it a might, fun you, you action that, romp so. i'm happy palate cleanser from the weird just give me some of the the john wicky bad boys you don't yeah. have to think about it too hard fun action and fun. yeah this is gonna be i will say low stakes but pretty low stakes yeah mm. but the stakes i think we all agree higher on this show the series was really good 
Yes. Came out of left field. I thought yeah. that I think our expectation was a little less, but that was great. This was a 15 minute podcast. See you next Hang time. Up. Bye. 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 Bye.